Carlos the Jackal is back on trial. The Venezuelan extremist, whose real name is Ilya Tremere Sanchez, is appealing a life sentence handed down last year for a 1974 grenade attack at a Paris drugstore that killed two people. His lawyers say the evidence against him is thin, but the jackal also loves to make the courtroom his own personal stage. Elias Ramirez Sanchez is still his old self, in great shape, despite being 68 years old. He's going to fight like he always does at every trial. This is far from the first trial for Ramirez, who is serving two additional life sentences for other murders. The jackal was one of the world's most notorious fugitives in the 1970s and 80s when he carried out terror attacks across Europe on behalf of the Palestinian cause. The self-styled revolutionary shot to infamy in 1975 after his commando took more than 60 people hostage and killed three at an OPEC meeting in Vienna. He remained on the run for 20 years, during which he carried out additional attacks, including several in France. In 1994, the jackal was finally captured in Sudan by French police and has remained in prison ever since. He has repeatedly bragged about other killings, but he denies any role in the Paris bombing that brings him to court once more. This is expected to be the final court appearance for Ramirez and his last chance to capture the world's attention.